Have you ever been in a situation whereby you opened something on your PC and Windows denied your access to the folder? Windows 10 giving you access denied folder errors when trying to open a folder? How do you fix these errors, if you are experiencing this? It's extremely annoying when Windows tells you don't have permission to access a file or folder on your own computer. There are different reasons the file slash folder might be giving you access denied error, but the major thing is if you are not an administrator on that computer or the file is set to be only accessible with admin right. Of course, it is very simple to fix. To fix this issue, you just need to have admin right on these files slash folders. In case you have admin rights on them and still see the access denied errors, here's how to fix them. To do this open the file explorer and navigate to the folder you are having issues with. Then right click on it and select properties. Next, click on the security tab. Under group, select any users and check if their permissions are set to be denied. If the area, select the user and click on edit to edit the user permission. Second method. Right click on the folder, and select properties. Next, click on the security tab and select the advanced button at the bottom of the window. From there, you'll be able to see the name and owner of the file slash folder. The name displays the location of the file while the owner basically displays the owner of the folder. However, if there is unable to display current owner in front of owner. Then click on the change link beside it to change the item's owner. Then from there, you'll need to choose which users or groups can access the folder. Then in the text box below they enter the object name to select box label, type in the name of your computer Dell to allow all admins to have access to it or even your username. Then click on check names button beside it, the text box will autocorrect it to name backslash administrators and click on OK to accept this. Once you've done that, you'll be taken to the advanced settings windows. Then check the replace owner on subcontainers and objects below the owner field. Ensure you check the box so that you can access everything inside it without having to repeat the steps again. Then click OK when you are done. Afterwards, try open the file and see whether you now have access to the folder. <laughs> 